Now, in part three of your book, which is about transformation, you talk about how to really tackle the world's toughest problems, you have to go beyond the interventions and really change systems and ecosystems. Um, tell us more about this and how do you go about doing something like that? You know, in the world of social good, many of the challenges that we try to tackle exist because both markets and policy have failed. You know, the business world is not serving people well, and the government isn't picking up the slack. Um, and so uh, when we just go ahead and kind of try to meet, fill that gap, it can just be putting Band-Aids on the problem because the system is fundamentally broken. And so I think it's important to go beyond just thinking about those Band-Aids and thinking about how do we change the system. If, if you, to use the example of homelessness, you know, if you provide you know, temporary housing for homeless people, you're certainly doing a good deed. You're certainly helping people that day. But unless you change the policy so that there is affordable housing available for people to rent or buy, and that there's a safety net um, from the government standpoint for people who are between jobs or you know, fall on hard times, it's gonna be a perpetual issue that we're gonna have to keep patching, right? And so it's looking beyond that sort of the symptom of the problem to, to how do we change the system so that the problem hopefully um, is overall reduced over time.